Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have an ASOS haul. Now, this is my first ASOS haul um, of this season. I kind of got like a bit of a weird order. A lot of it was coats. I think I got was it four coats, three coats. I think I got like three or four coats and a jacket. I also did do a makeup order on ASOS as well. So I'm not really gonna include this in a video. I am doing a um, like a full face of a new drugstore makeup, like first impressions. Um, so that's going to be up on my channel either before this one or after this one. If it's already up, I'll leave it in the description down below. If it's not, then please make sure to check that out. And honestly, I didn't realise how much makeup brands ASOS stocked. It had all like the drugstore makeup, it had so many high end products, it has like Essay Lauder, um, I think it has like Charlotte Tilbury, NARS. That has it in decay but then it had all like drugstore like nyx uh, maybelline l'oreal like it has so many like foundations and everything and then obviously the discount works on it as well because i've tried like other makeup brands and the discount codes don't work on some of the brands whereas on asos if you have like a shoe discount or a discount code it literally works on everything so i highly recommend um checking asos for makeup that you want because I've actually never, because like everything was in stock as well, so highly recommend that. And they had like new products on there as well, like new collaborations and everything, so highly recommend that. Anyway, um, so in this video, yes, I've got coats, I've also got a dress and I think it's a cardigan, so it's not like the most like is helpful, but it's very good for coats, so I'm really intrigued to try these on. Um, a dress that's very much out of my comfort zone. I've never really wore this style of dress before, and I'm also the cardigan. I'm quite excited for because I want to try um, more cardigans. So I think they're good, especially like if you're going in and out of places. If you put like a big coat on, but then you like you're too hot in like a really big thick jumper. But I think sometimes cardigans are nice because they're easy to take off. And you've got like a cute little top underneath. So I think they're very good for this seasonal change when it's cold, but it's not too cold for a coat. So you just put a cardigan on. You know what I mean? If you don't want to wear a jumper. Anyway, let's get on into the video because I'm rambling way too much. <laughs> okay guys, so this is the first coat. Um, as you can see, it's got like black buttons down the side. These are the sleeves, like cuff sleeves. It's very long, I don't know if you can see the bottom, so it's near enough to my ankles. It's like that far from my ankles and I'm 5'7". What I will say, I'm just looking at my mirrors beside me. This coat is ginormous. Okay, so I already knew it was going to be oversized, so I don't really like two oversized things. It just doesn't really suit me. I got this in a size 4, like the smallest size possible, and I'm usually like a size 8. Like, this drowns me. I just, I just think I look like I've popped on. It's like a different colour, it's like I've popped on like my dad's coat or something. I just, I don't think this suits me at all. I love the colour. But, I don't know, I just feel like I look like a drowned rat. Or like, I'm playing in like a school theatre or something. Like it just, I don't know, it doesn't seem like, this is the back. But if you can like, pull off the like oversized look, then do it. Like honestly, I think if like, if you like styled it nicer, because I've just got like joggers on at the minute. If you like styled it nicer, I feel like you could really make this coat work. So, honestly, it's gorgeous. So, like this is the pattern, you can see. So it's got like, different colours in there but it is really pretty and it, honestly it's like so nice and warm and it's like there's so much room in it like you can definitely fit like jumpers underneath but I don't know I do you really like it, it just it's very oversized so taking that into account if you're going to buy this coat that like I'm usually a size 8 and I got size 4 and it's still so oversized so if you're like I dread to know what the 8's like because like look how much fabric is in this coat like this ton so just take that into consideration if you're going to buy this but it's a lovely coat it's a lovely colour different just, it looks expensive i can't remember how much it was but i will pop this at price on the screen um but oh, i wish it was a bit smaller because i think i'd really love it and it's got nice massive pockets as well on the side like two big pockets hmm. I like her to like it the more I look at it. Um, let me know your, what your opinions are. Do we like it? Do we not? Do you think it's too big? I don't think there's a smaller size than size 4. So if you are 
naturally decided to fall then I do think it would drown you and it is like not dead heavy but I don't know. but anyway this is the comb let's get the next one on hey guys so this is the second jacket I think I'm in love like this is gorgeous so it's like this what is it is that that? no it's a suede um like aviator style jacket honestly this fur goes all inside it's so soft let me show you so this is on the inside and it goes like throughout and it's like down the sleeves it's so soft um <laughs> honestly it's absolutely gorgeous so it's like two-toned because obviously like um the suede is like one color and the fur is different it's got these silver zits but honestly it is gorgeous i'm so so impressed like just look at this show you the back like i'm obsessed it is lovely like come on this is like 100 yes oh it also has like it's like different colored piping as well i just think this is so nice especially to break up like a really like dark outfit obviously because like, right now i've got all black on and like i just think it breaks up i think it'll look nice with like blues colored outfits black outfits like everything it's just it's so pretty like i'm really like falling in love with this i wish i got this in eight and it's like the perfect size it's so cozy and it's so different to everything i have like i have a lot of like black or like browns but like long i don't have anything like this i am so so happy with it i love it i think this is a definite yes from me but let me know what you think thumbs up okay so this one isn't going to be everyone's cup of tea um i do have quite different styles so there are is like one of my styles is like that very like chanel-esque style so i do love tweed blazers so this is like, I'm just going to throw it like a gorgeous, like a white, like it has like a bit of sparkle in it. So these are the cuffs. So I think cuffs are dead important to look at. I think you can see like the sparkle in it. I just think it's gorgeous. These are the buttons. Like that's like the bottom of it. And I do think it's so pretty. I just think it looks so elegant. Obviously not really with my joggers. <laughs> um, but I just think this would look so nice. It's like it looks so much more expensive than what it was. I can't actually remember the price, but again, I'll put it on the screen. Only issue is, it's slightly itchy. Like, I think it's the glitter in it, so it's like itching me a bit around my neck. But I think if I had like a, a turtleneck on or something, which is obviously like more winter style, like it wouldn't really bother me, but I think it's like a gorgeous fit. These pockets? Not really. But like, there's got slits there as if it was like a pocket. But it's just so pretty. something good for my bank account but no i really really like it i think it's so so pretty what do you guys think does it look does it look expensive like obviously you want that chanel look but on like a high-end price not a no high, sh high street price not high oh my god i can't speak today um a high street price but do you know i really like it what do we think is it a yes or is it a no Okay guys, so this is the next item. This is a cardigan, it's from River Island. Um, what do we think? It's got um, little pockets here. These are the gold oh, gold buttons. There's three of them, I think. One, two, three, yeah, three. Um, I wanted a cardigan because I, just, I really want to invest in a cardigan that's nice. I do have one cardigan that I wear a lot, but it's not, it's not really my style. It's a grey one, but I want more because I just think they are very versatile and useful have in this season but i don't know if this one looks like i stole my grandma's cardigan she always wore cardigans to my grandma as well um but it's actually really soft and cozy like i do like really love it um i'm just thinking do i love it enough to wear it i don't know i can't remember the price i think it was like 30 pound but the price is still on me i'll put it on screen anyway but i'm curious how much was it yeah it was 30 pounds what do we think or well, what do you guys think do i keep it or do i not oh, i'm so undecided it is really nice and i'm just thinking to myself like what more would i be looking for in a cardigan than this like what doesn't this offer me 
you know, it's a, it's a nice versatile colour, I think it's an autumnal colour. It's like a grey with like maybe like a slight purpley grey. Um, it's got lovely gold buttons, which is why I want. I like gold like accessories or like gold detailing. It's got lovely pockets. It's not just flat because the pockets bring it up a bit more. It's got like a ribbed hem, ribbed collar down there. So it has got everything I've been looking for. So maybe I will keep it. Maybe it is nice. Maybe I just need to style it a bit differently. Um, you know, I do like it. And it is really soft. Thirty pounds, probably a little expensive for what it is. But I do think it would last well, like it doesn't look like a material that's going to like go bitty or bobbly or anything really quickly so maybe you would get your money's worth out of it. But let me know what you guys think, okay? Okay guys, so this is the final coat of this haul. It's a long line, beige browny, um, like double breasted coat. It's lovely. It's very much something like I had before but I just really like like the extra detailing on the sleeves with this like cuff and this button and you can also tie it so like say you didn't want to just like button it up you can like tie it tie it tighter with this you can like and I think that just adds so much like more detail you can see that like this is the back of it I just think I think it just looks so expensive um, and like luxurious, like, I think it really makes it look like you put so much effort in. Say you like didn't have clothes, I feel like like you didn't have a nice outfit. This is your outfit. Like this literally covers your whole outfit, but you look put together. You look like you've made tons of effort. Like oh, I just love it. Like you can't even tell that I've just got like drugs and a little crop top on. Like if I put some nice shoes on, it literally looks like I'm a million pounds. Do you not think? <laughs> um, but no, I really like this. Bloody hell, I can't keep buying all these coats. But coats really are like my staple thing for autumn winter. I just love them to pieces. And I don't have one with like a tie belt. Oh, I do love it. I really, really love it. And it's got like nice pockets on the side. Um, the inside is just like silk lined. What do we think? Is it a yes or is it no? I do really like it though. I don't know if I should have gone for like the size down maybe. Like I feel like when it's open it does look quite like it's drowning me, but I feel like like one size smaller probably wouldn't have made tons of difference. But yeah, this is it. I think it's getting a yes from me. I think it's another coat that I'm keeping, which is just terrible. But it is different to what I've got and I don't think I'd find like a tie coat that I like any nicer than this one. I think it is just gorgeous, like Here's the sleeves, buttons, the pockets. I think it is just gorgeous. So I think it is another yes from me. Okay guys, so this is the final item. It's a shirt dress. Um, should I take this off? Maybe I should have in case I don't keep it. So I don't like it styled like this. I wanted a shirt dress because I feel like everyone's doing this shirt trend at the minute. But I think with a jumper over the top of the collar, which is what everyone seems to be doing, and then like knitted vests, I need to get one of them because I don't have one. And then I can belt, I think it'd look a lot nicer. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to just quickly show you it without like anything on it. And I'm going to just quickly pop a jumper on and see what that looks like. Okay guys, so this is kind of like how I've quickly styled it. Um, so I've just put this grey jumper on from Topshop, this was last year, and I've just like stuck the collar out. And I've also like put a belt underneath just to like tighten up and add something to tuck the jumper into. But I think this shirt is actually really good quality. Like I have like bright pink knickers on under this and you can't even see it. Well I hope you can't. <laughs> um, but no, I really like it. I think it's like a perfect length. Like I have like pulled it up a bit like underneath just to get like a nice length. Like I don't know, I do really like this and I think this is like a cute outfit and like an effortless out again, like it's just comfy, like it's comfy but you look good and I think like that's what I'm all for and I think with some like cute tights, like some black tights and pattern tights or even some sink cord or even without no tights and like some little boots, I think it would look so nice, um, but yeah I think this is so cute and with one of them like knitted vests that are really in at the minute, like that could be worn instead of this jumper and you can like Pull the sleeves out as well if you want, like you could roll the sleeves up, like literally do like whatever you want to do with this. I think it's just so sweet, like another effortlessly nice outfit. 
Um, I do think I'd, keep, I'd probably keep this. Only because, like, I don't know if I'll 100% get the buyer on it, but it was a really good price. I'm pretty sure this was, like, 17 99 And I don't really see shirt dresses for that price. And especially, like, with this quality. Like, it doesn't feel amazing when you fit. It feels like when you put it on, like, it really is good quality. Like, I put, like, a ring light and everything on me now. It's not see-through. And it's just really, really pretty. And it's, like, the perfect length for me. Like, it doesn't stick out too much. It's not, like, tight on me. And it just stops at the perfect part of my legs. Like... I'm very self-conscious at the very top of my thighs and this just can stop right below the part and then it just makes me feel so confident. I don't really care what I look like from the back, like this is from the back, so it's probably not the most flattering but I never care what I look like from the back because I can't see it so it doesn't really bother me. Um, but I'll quickly take the, trump the jumper off and show you what it just looks like with the shirt and just the belt. Okay, so this is what it looks like with just a belt. If I pull the sleeves up slightly and like over tucked it a little bit. Um, Again, like any style of belt would work, and I just think this would look so nice. Like, pop on some like little heels, and I think you've got like such a cute like drinks with the girls outfit, or, like a little date night outfit. It's just so like simple and effortless, and it's just comfy. Or if like even if you've got work, and then you're going to meet your friends afterwards, perfect outfit. Um, but yeah, I really really like it. I don't know if I'm 100% confident in it wearing it like this, because I don't 100% know if it's my style. But I see so many girls doing it and they're just like, amazing. I think it'll look better with like a, maybe like a bigger belt or like a different colour. Maybe like a beige belt or something like that. But no, I really, really like it. So again, like, this is it. Oh, my sleeves popped down. So there you go. I'll show you the sleeves down. That's what it looks like with the sleeves down. And it's one of them, like, you know, if it's like a cold night, you can hide your sleeves down. But then when you get inside, you can pull them up for like extra fashion. <laughs> um, but yeah. I do feel like this now working because I do think it's such good quality for the price it is and I do think I'll get aware of that in terms of like layering it with like a jumper and say you're like you're going somewhere and you're dead hot in your jumper you can take it off and you still like look acceptable like underneath so yeah this is my outfit and I really like it but let me know what you guys think am I just an idiot and this does not suit me whatsoever this is a terrific outfit and so is the jumper because I think it's nice but I'm one of them where I'll think it's nice and then now later I'll come back and go god that was awful but if someone tells me like that was awful you need to tell me because I can't look like, like a muppet going outside in this jumper and this top if I do just look stupid in it but anyway yeah let me know what you guys think and yeah this kind of concludes the whole and that was awful let me just do that again yeah guys, so this concludes the haul now. This is my final outfit. Um, so yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this. I really did. I think I got some really good coats. Let's just leave this down. Hey guys, so this concludes the haul. Um, I really hope you enjoyed it. I did, and I'm obsessed with that um, aviator coat. Like That is my favourite thing of all time, and I really like the belted one as well. I did like the tweed one as well, but it was just slightly itchy. I might need to try that on with like a different outfit to see if it's still itchy. Um, I think the pink one is going to have to go back, just because it drowns me. But it is so pretty, so if you like that oversized look, then I 100% recommend it. It's gorgeous. Um... The cardigan I'm still a bit undecided on. I do really like it, um, but I think I need to think about that one. And this top. Again, I'm still undecided, but I just think the quality and the price of it, it just seeks for itself. I think I just need to keep it and just try and style it. It probably will be in like a clear on my wardrobe video next year, but I think I want to try it. I want to try expand my style and my wardrobe and really just try out different fashion styles and this is really in trend at the minute so yeah i feel like my hair has gone so flat now from changing all these outfits um but yeah let me know what you guys thought of everything i've shown in today's video down in the comments below please 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 subscribe to my channel and like this video it would really mean the world to me and i hope you all have an amazing day see you in my next video bye